I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I was really impressed with some of your papers on the struggle for social reform in America. One paper was outstanding, in fact. Economic growth and power are the means, not the definition of a great nation. Brilliant, Tomas. Well said. Thank you, Ms. Pellis. <laughs> <laughs> so did you miss me at Jessica's party last night? Yes, of course. Everybody was there. Everyone but you. Yeah, Tommy. Like, whatever. Lately you've been missing, like, everything. All the good stuff. <laughs> don't be mad, ladies. I'm busting my ass in soccer training. As long as you don't forget about me. Come on, Vi. You know I'm doing this to get that scholarship. So we can be at the same school next year. I know. See you later. Bye, Bye guys. guys. Better get going now. But I'll see you later. Okay. Great game, guys. Good work, yeah, buddy. Good, good work. Hey, guys. Coach. Good game. Yeah. Yep, Tom, can I have a word with you? Sure, Coach. Listen, Tom, I got a phone call this morning concerning you. And, uh, what about? Well, it was from a head coach at a certain university. Apparently, he uh, wants you on his team next season. What? <laughs> They're processing your paperwork now. No, no way. <laughs> Full scholarship, kiddo. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> and I can't think of anybody who serves it more than you do, Tom. Congratulations, boy. Thanks, Coach. I can't wait to tell my mother. Hey, keep an eye on the mail for the uh, letter from that guy. Thanks. Hola, ma. Estamos de buen humor hoy. ¿Comes en casa? Sí. ¿Has hablado con Coach Sosa? No. ¿Por qué? ¿Pasó algo? Siéntate. Hay algo que quiero contarte. Tommy, ¿qué pasa? Nada. Lo llamaron a Coach de la universidad y aparentemente quieren que juegue para su equipo. No. <risa> ¿En serio? Sí, Pool Scholarship. Te dije que me lo iban a dar. Te quiero, te quiero, te quiero, te quiero. Tú te la mereces todo, hijo mío. Gracias, madre. ¿Qué está pasando aquí? Hey, big boy. ¿Por qué gritan? A tu hermano le dieron una beca completa para ir a la universidad. ¿Es eso correcto? Sí, kiddo. Sweet, I'll have the whole bedroom to myself next year. <laughs> ok, boys. Oh, wash your hands. Dinner will be ready in five minutes.
Hola Jorge, ¿cómo estás? Soy Alicia. Sí, me acaban de llamar de la Universidad de Tommy. Me dieron una beca completa. Muy bueno. Pero parece que hay problemas con el socio. Sí, sí, no, no coincide. Ya, ya lo sé, ahí, ahí está el problema. Si no tiene la ciudadanía o la residencia, no va a poder ir. Y como estamos ilegales por tanto tiempo, ni siquiera se va a poder sacar una visa de estudiante. ¿Tommy? Jorge, me tengo que ir. Ok, hablamos luego. Ok, bye. ¿Tommy? Por favor. Por favor, sale el cuarto. Necesito hablar, por favor. ¿Es verdad lo que acabo de escuchar? ¿No estamos legales? Escucha, hijo. La vida no ha sido fácil para nosotros. Sobre todo después de que tu padre nos dejó. ¡No me importa! ¡Contesta mi pregunta! Tommy. Abre la puerta. ¿Por qué nunca me dijiste nada? No sé. No quería matar tus sueños. No quería que fueras diferente. ¿Diferente? Por favor, dime que no es verdad, mamá. Dime que podré ir a la universidad, por favor. Mira, hijo. No sé si vas a ir a esta universidad o a otra. Pero no tenemos residencia. Y va a ser muy difícil que cambiemos nuestro estatus. No sé, no sé. A no ser que haya una amnistía o algo, pero es... Pero si me había dicho que éramos residentes, porque Benjamín había nacido aquí. Mamá, ¿qué pasó? Get out of here, man. No le hables así. Benjamín, ve a ver la tele. Quería que cumplieras tus sueños. ¿Mis sueños? Mi sueño era esto. ¿Y ahora? Tommy. Tommy, por favor. Hey, Tommy. Wow. Hey there, Jorge. Sit down, son. Thanks. Your mother told me what happened today. Not easy, Miguel. Yeah, I know. I heard you two uh, talking on the phone earlier. Be good to her, Tommy. She's a good woman. I've known your family since you were this little. I know exactly what you're going through. This immigration thing very hard. Yeah, I know now. When I first came here, I didn't have any papers, you know? But then I met Rita. She was nice. And we got along. Rita, she was a U.S. citizen. So you know, we got married, y pues, here I am. Now you're almost a man, Tomasito. You know what I'm trying to say?
So tell me, how's your girlfriend doing? And what's her name? Of course I love you. And I would marry you. Not now. We're too young. I know, Vi. I'm sorry. I, I don't even know what I'm saying. I just... just don't know what I'm gonna do. This idea, this asshole Jorge put in my head. the immigration attorney and he thinks you have a decent shot of getting in. That's great. With an understanding judge and a little luck, you could win this thing, but... What if we don't win? Yeah. What if the judge rolls against us? You're going to be raising a flag here, guys. If you don't win the case, he could be facing deportation. What? No. There's got to be another way. Look, I, uh, I set an appointment up with the immigration attorney for next week for all of you guys. And he'll explain everything. Let's just stay positive about this, okay? And, and be hopeful. It's going to work out. Vagabundeando por el mundo sin cesar Sin encontrar un cariño tan igual Que se fue Pues soy Un vagabundo que andando por el mundo Va y la pueda encontrar Y así Poder mirarnos y olvidarnos del pasado que ocurrió en nuestro amor. Vagabundo soy, que voy por el mundo Vagabundo soy, que voy por el mundo Vagabundo soy, que voy por el mundo Pues soy un vagabundo que andando por el mundo baila pueda encontrar Y así poder mirarnos y olvidarnos del pasado que ocurrió en nuestro amor 